5 a.m., another awesome, amazing day. Dr. Rob Kiltz, how are you doing today? Welcome to all the Mighty Tribe members or soon to be or like not sure, but uh, it's an amazing day. Trini, let's see, Trin, uh, Enol, oh boy, cosmetics, awesome. NY Cali, hot. Good morning, mama. Good morning, baby. Oh, ba uh, uh, bag lady black, awesome. Good morning, good, good afternoon, good evening, good night, and the top of the morning. It's Dr. Rob Kiltz. Randy, how you doing? Jason, amazing. Uh, another beautiful day in the universe. And uh, just simply being grateful every day, Chucky, right? Grateful every day. Uh, Dean, good morning. Cardo, CNN. Uh, I, I've got my crazy shirt on and I'm thinking you get to make your own uh, shirts basically uh, with uh, half you and half lion. Ultimately, we're truly uh, part of the lion clan, right? That's the master work for New Zealand. Love New Zealand. Awesome. Uh, where are you at in this world? Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Good night. Top of the morning, up early, 3 a.m. I did my rowing work and then my resistance work. Uh, always doing my rowing and resistance. Oh, this resistance stuff is hard to do, right? It's hard to do hard. But when you do enough hard, it becomes, guess what? Easy. Uh, our team made it. Uh, we're going to put these up. And then again, I'm going to put a button, custom, your face, half lines. Isn't that crazy? Uh, we're having fun in this journey every single day. And uh, uh, we're, let's see, today is show up. Show up. All you need to do is show up to the party, the class, the front of the class, the top of the stage, be doing it every single day, right? We are here to do what? Something, right? Three people in the world, the watchers, the complainers, and the doers. And we're in the doing class. And the more you do, the more you grow, the more you learn, the more you realize it's all okay. It's all perfect. You're going in the right way. Netabu, good morning. Bevy, uh, uh, Crazy Doc, Kilts, Hey You, Rob. It doesn't matter. Uh, Roseanne, uh, grateful for you, by the way. Jennifer Francisco, good morning. Fernandez, DB from DC. Awesome. Lucas, how are you doing, my friends? It is an awesome day. All right, I've got to just do one thing on my, on my uh, mighty tribe. Let's see if it brings up. Uh, let's see if it allows. All right. Mariah, Sandy, New Orleans, Arizona, mighty tribe, CNY Fertility, Dr. Kiltz, and, uh, and uh, Facebook, YouTube. We're just at the Shalom. Shalom. Shalom, my friends. Uh, shalom, God bless, namaste, inshallah. Uh, it's all about honoring the God within all of us, right? Uh, we're, we're here to have a conversation, not to criticize. Although critiquing uh, is, is, you know, but a lot of what we need to do is step back and listen and learn. Uh, David, Dr. David Diamond, really, 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 really great. Uh, uh, Sa, uh, S. Sanga. Roni, Roni or Ronnie, uh, I'm doing awesome. I see that you're doing awesome. Wherever you're at, New Orleans, Arizona, New Zealand, uh, Chris, Deuterium, uh, Joey Schwartz video. Joey is amazing. Uh, Joey and I are thinking going to do a live this Sunday. Uh, Joey should be a CNN, Carnivore News Network roving reporter. I've got my little press uh, uh, pass to let me end the most a most uh, important places, right? All of it is important and open for all of our lives. All this top secret, really? Listen, the truth shall set you free. When we open up, expose all of our worries and fears, and I don't want anyone to know this, let it go. You heal everything, right, Sam? Pressed on. Let's see, cherishing your health. Good morning, Cherish. Uh, honoring all of those great cheerleaders and coaches, right? That's what I've learned is the best doctor. If you go to a doctor and they're chastising you in negativity, walk away. God, excuse me, doctor. If you want to be my coach and cheerleader and help me be better, be positive, right? But the real trick is we're going we're gonna to help them be positive. That's what this journey is about. All right, I got to look for my, the, uh, my books. Oh, we, we, I'm sure everyone has read The Biology of Belief because that was part of our, our book series. Uh, this week is uh, 
What is this week? Oh, the seven habits of highly effective people by Stephen Covey, right? So are you reading things that will change your life? Mumbai, India, Zach O'Fall, welcome and thank you very much. Listen, whether you're a vegan, vegetarian, Mediterranean, pescatarian, or you're a carnivarian, you're welcome at Kiltz's uh, Mighty Tribe. We're just listening and learning. Bonjour, uh, Bella France. Uh, Miss Tia, my partner, was just in France, Paris, a few weeks ago. She loves it. She loves Paris, Germany. Uh, we're, 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 we're working to get to Spain, travel the world, and meet people all over. But you know what I love about this? I can be in your living room, your kitchen, your backyard, your workspace, and you can be in mine. That's the beauty of communication through our devices. And we have so many amazing ways. And Malcolm, who's in the background here, but he's helping make sure it's all going right, adding some connections in all of this. Uh, I've been, I'm really, really, really onto this crazy concept of uh, glycans. What's a glycan? What's a glycan? What's a glycan? Glycans are sugars. They're important for glycosylation, the proper folding of a protein. And we're eating plant glycans that are deadly for us in any significance. Nafs, how you doing? Al uh, Zakia. Uh, I hope they get the right. KG Maria, uh, SLCR95, Michael uh, O. Nijner. Nij -er. <laughs> Jess Stevenson, hello. Ari, uh, let's see. Arini uh, A. Renee, 321. Countries have you been to? Not enough. Not enough. Canada, Mexico, uh, Costa Rica. Now, I've been to Costa Rica. Let's see. Uh, the Caribbean. Uh, let's see. I've been to. Uh, I've been to uh, Italy. I've been to uh, uh, France, England. I have many more travels to do. Many more. Good morning, Fitz. Uh, uh, fitness with Jam. Listen again. Every day, you got to do some motion. Exercise is dead, but you want to do creative motion, right? You want to you want to you want to take care of the mind first to master the body to master your life. That's really it, right? Crazy. Low blood sugar drops are in carnivore. How to manage it? Listen, low sugar is good for you. It's kind of like low temperature and breathing. See, when you eat plants, you keep your sugar artificially high. That's deadly. You're addicted. When it drops, you're like, oh, my God, I have to have sugar. Your body makes sugar, all the sugar it requires. That's why carnivore is the game changer, right? Tonight at about 7 p.m., and uh, I'll put it out there, 5.30, 6.30, maybe, yeah, five, six. Uh, Kiltz is going to be cooking. And what's Kiltz cooking? Well, uh, he's going to be cooking some uh, Alpine and Snake River steaks, uh, some liver from uh, Bell and Evans chicken liver, and we'll see how it goes. Uh, live with Kilts. Maybe I could get Malcolm to come over and do the filming live, or I love doing it myself anyway. Uh, sure, we'll get you. Look at Chucky. Again, uh, the Mighty Tribe uh, is we're all mastering all of us to recognize we're the lions, right? Uh, whoever you are, you start here, but we're sheep. But when we recognize that we're really the masterful lions of life, it's a game changer, right? That's why I love Michaela Peterson's uh, lion diet, right? Carnivore, uh, my new religion. Listen, uh, faith in God always, right? Sandy, how you doing? Uh, I love Bell and Evan's liver. It's today's lunch with bacon and eggs. It's awesome. It's awesome. You're right. Toronto, Canada. Awesome. Gourget. Sindhu. Sindhu? Uh, a pleasure. Sandy. New Orleans and uh, Autumn Spinoza. Brooklyn, New York. I'm here to share my ideas, whether you believe them or not, on why, why I've gone from this to this. This is the way, the new way. Kilts is carnivore is the way. Amazing craziness, right? And uh, what we're we're going to be at the at the at the New York Symposium Keto Symposium, July, June, September twenty fourth, 
with Miss Maria Emmerich and more. Uh, maybe we'll do a live with Maria when we're there. Who knows? Uh, but we're going to be bringing some T-shirts to give away. We've got some new magazines we're going to be selling uh, or giving away. I don't know. Win something fantastic because you're already the winner of life. What's the winner of life? You're alive. Now you're alive. Get off the couch. Stop complaining. Uh, it's not anyone else's fault. You're responsible for the magic miracle machine. You are, right? Uh, love, love is the way for 20. I love you, my friend. Uh, let's see, reading these days. Oh, this week, it's uh, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People, Stephen Covey. Next week's book, I don't remember what it is. Uh, uh, it's a sick crazy, isn't it? I don't know. A part of me was like, I can't wear that. Even Kilts is like, is that a little crazy? It is. But uh, we have to be a little crazy, right? Uh, being strong, 2.0, awesome. Four years carnivore, uh, heaviest in muscle mass. I've gained weight, right? I still have a little bit of this. Listen, this is for this is for when I go on my three day fast, like this week, right? I'm on I'm on uh, I'm in my last 12 hours, right? 6 p.m. I maybe 7 p.m. 6:45 to 7. Watch out for a live YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. Kilts is cooking. What's he making? He's making some Snake River steak, some uh, uh, some Alpine uh, 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 ribeye, and also some uh, Bell and uh, Evans chicken livers. And also throwing in some blue cheese, milky blue cheese from Wegmans, and some uh, butter from Wegmans. So uh, let's see. Sassy, good morning. Uh, you're sick, right? But remember, uh, there are those viruses out there, and they love the the glycation that's going on in our body. G l y c a t i o n glycation. Glycation is basically rust of your body. Rust. What's the rust from? Because you're consuming a plant based, low animal fat diet. Get to the carnivore way, right? The lioness and the lions. They rule the earth, right? Uh, let's see. What are you guys reading these days? What are you reading? Uh, you got to be reading, listening, watching, positive and inspiring. You know, if you're watching shit that's about doom and gloom, you're going to fuck up in the brain because whatever you watch, your brain says, oh, my gosh, like zombies and 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 negative shit is going to be my life. And you don't want that anymore. And if you haven't watched Veritasium, uh, one of my really favorites, Veritasium uh, on truth. I, on, let's see, really great stuff. The illusion of truth, uh, uh, Veritasium. Uh, I'll send it, uh, put a link on there, Malcolm, because I love Veritasium, V-E-R-I-T-A-S-I-U-M, Veritasium, the illusion of truth. Listen, whatever you listen to watch of any significance becomes who and what you are, right? Uh, so listen, uh, Netabu, I know you love them, but if you want to get to the next class, listen, uh, Game of Thrones, I'll go with that. The Vikings, I'll go with that. Listen, what you want to do is understand that you and I are the ancient hunters. Why do we feel sleepy after a fatty meal? Because you're meant to rest and digest after a fatty meal, you want to see, uh, that's why I eat my meal at night, my one meal at night, because sleeping after your meal, a fatty meal is healthy for you. All this thing is like, you shouldn't go to sleep for four hours. Who's fucking making that shit up? Listen, again, science. And again, the illusion of science is you think it's truth. Sometimes maybe it's fake, right? Uh, well, let's see. Awesome. Pat, uh, Pat Minas 05. How are you doing? Welcome, Dr. Rob Kiltz. I'm a fertility physician. I've learned so much about the false, the falsehood of the nutrition we've been shared. It's about money, not mommies, men and masters, unfortunately. Again, no disrespect to those that are doing the science. But if you really want to be open minded, you have to look at all sides. And when they tell you not to go keto, paleo, uh, or Atkins, and next they're going to tell you not to go carnivore. Because if you go carnivore, you're going to step up to the master class. 
That's it. Carnivore Health PCOS, uh, HT, Rich uh, Reichelman. Uh, absolutely. Carnivore Keto Cures All. Look at Judy Cho's book on, on Carnivore Cure. My first book uh, on, uh, on, on food was uh, Keto Cures, but they, they, it's like, oh, they're going to de they're gonna deactivate you. Uh, I know they deactivated Judy Cho for a little bit, but she came back strong. And remember, we're the strong warriors, right? Get into the, get into the studio and lift some weights, right? Uh, if you can lift them easily, go to the next level. Uh, look at Sean Baker, Ken Berry, Judy Cho. Look at uh, Anthony Chafee. Uh, look at uh, uh, Zaldivar, Dr. Zaldivar. And uh, I've got to remember all these names. Sometimes my brain is like, what? What book are you re reading these days? Boris Barris. Barris uh, D3K2. Uh, welcome, welcome. Carnivore Cured, PCOS, Rosanna. Uh, that's, that's, listen, share the stories. Go to Kiltz's Mighty Tribe. And uh, uh, we're going to throw in some freebies there at some time. Uh, let's see, 420, love, 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 right? Love, love, love every day, right? Bevy, what do you think about 80 fat, 20 protein, three to four meals that Ke uh, Kelly Hogan and Dr. Carnivore? I don't recommend three to four meals a day. Why do you spend so much money on food? You don't need to. Listen, our body needs, a, yes, 80-20, 80% 80 fat at calories. But what's a calorie? I don't know. Stop fucking measuring. You don't need so much food, right? All right. 365 Tao. Yes. Yes. Great book. What's next week's book? I don't remember. The Fat Burn Fix. Listen, we only burn fat. If you haven't figured the one out, the body does not burn sugar, then fat. Fuck no. Sorry, insulin resistance is untrue. Glucose is just another glycan. When you read about glycobiology and you get with get with this Kiltz's craziness, right? Sugar is just another glycan. And all sugars go to the liver and they're converted to fat or they're utilized as glycosylation. But we're not meant to eat plants of any significance or frequency. Jonathan uh, is a crazy shit, right? I don't know. My team does all these shirts and they say, Really? And then we've got the KMT, Kiltz's Mighty Tribe. Uh, but I'll be long. I'm, I'm, I'll be long to your tribes, too, because we're all co-creating, right? These tri We're tribal. Our ancient ancestors are tribal. We're not a big city. That's deadly for all of us. But we have our small tribes that we can communicate. Christy, good morning. Jonathan, whoa Carnivore code, lies my doctor told me, the carnivore diet, they're all really great. Good, 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 good. Uh, look at look at glycobiology. We have a link out there somewhere. Malcolm's going to make sure it's in our in our YouTube and go to drkilts.com. Uh, the sugar code, my friends. And and I'm I'm uh, I'm printing off all these uh all these papers. I love this stuff. Love it. Love it. Love it. Without sugars, we're dead. Yep. We're dead. Uh, all right, I'm working on it. I'm getting there. Uh, protein folding is critical, but it requires sugars to do that. Without the sugars, there's no, there's no protein folding. It doesn't exist. I know. Craziness, right? All right. Uh, I know a lot of arguments by now, but what would your response be to someone who claims that meat is causing the body to be acidic? Uh, a boy with a girl's name. I'm not here to argue. Uh, let's see. The, the body maintains a very narrow pH. That's it. What you eat in the acidic stomach and meat is quickly digested. It goes into your, it, the, the fat goes lymphatics, the amino acids and sugars go to the liver there are sugars in meat, by the way, and uh, your body uh, maintains a very narrow hemostasis. And, and I'm not arguing. I'm, not, I'm just telling you, I eat fatty meat every day. Bingo, never felt this better. I eat one meal a day and it's high fat. You don't need to have three meals a day. Listen, 
meat food is just to fuel the Ferrari for the everything creative. Stop focusing on food. It's not entertainment. It's you stop at the gas station or you plug it in, be on your way to go do the things that you want to be creative about, right? Right. Even though Kilts, Kilts is working at, at uh, being the rock star, uh, Bruce Springsteen's mother is my mother's cousin. Mm -hmm. argue with you my friends but i'm listening and learning today carnivore is the way i know i've been doing it for nearly 12 years never felt better both local and online i both all of it right and we're learning 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 every single day my friends in the end and god's all there is right that's why I wear this thing to remind me of Jesus Christ, but it's Buddha, Mount Lao Tse, Mohammed, Abraham. It doesn't matter. Eat the fat, my friend. Rendered fat makes me tired and nauseated. It means go to sleep, do a rest. Netabu. You got to do the dance of life, right? I bought my uh, box guitar, Jonathan, a box uh, drum. Uh, we're all learning and living this journey together. Do we make, make mistakes? Do we look foolish? Fuck yes. It's okay, right? Very lucky. No one said anything negative about my diet. My chair, well, then you're not sharing it enough, right? Autumn, awesome. Uh, uh, let's see. You got to keep sharing, but it's okay. Look, it, there's lots of positives and negatives in life. It's okay, right? Vegetarian who told me this. Uh, claims the meat makes us acidic and vegetables make you alkaline ladder is what you, uh, well, look at your body. The pH is very narrow. I'm sorry. Uh, have you ever looked at the vegan and the color of their skin, the gauntness of their body? I'm telling you, listen, lines, listen, my skin has never looked or felt better. My whole body, my energy, uh, acid pH baseline, uh, because we are carnivore CNN. Listen, thank you very much for sharing your ideas. Keep them coming, right? Kilts is an idiot some days, right? I'm stupid and dumb. I'm just a man, right? Uh, feed me, flatter me, and you know what me. But ultimately, listen, we're here for a, just an amazing life every day. F love, uh, kindness, generosity, gratitude. Nothing more nutritious, delicious than a fresh fatty ribeye steak. And you're meant to eat fatty foods, fatty meat, and then sleep. Bingo. That's why I switched from vegan to carnivore. Uh, awesome. Listen, you're, we're just having a conversation. There's no argument here, right? There's no criticism in a negative way. It's critiquing ideas. Listen, I spend a lot of money, time, and energy to become a doctor. And believe me, I'm taking care of many sick patients. But what I've learned about all the diseases we suffer from, it's because we are this, but we're eating like the animal that came from this, right? Uh, I know. Wait a minute. Dr. Gilts, really? Yes. I know. Listen. Uh, we are we are eating like these animals, but we need to be eating like these animals, right? This is the game changer, the new book. Okay, uh, make sure we get the link for the uh, for the symposium, the keto symposium in New York City, July. Uh, no, September. I want to say July, September twenty fourth in New York. Uh, let's see, beta diet, how to clear it, pepsin supplements for better digestion of protein. Uh, your protein digests very well. You have a bad, sick GI system that needs to heal. Fasting is lasting. I'm on my three-day fast, game changer. Uh, I do 23 and one every single day. And once a month, I do 72 hours. I don't know. I'm doing a little bit of 48 sometimes. I'm not sure where it is. You are lucky, Bevy. Uh, fit with uh, Merrick. How you doing? Uh, Bez. Bez. Glute, gluten, oh, no, uh, awesome. Jack, 
Jack Ryan, awesome. Joel, 5764. Thank you for connecting. We're all co-following each other. We're learning from each other. Uh, we're making the science is sometimes so complicated. I mean, look at look at all the diseases that we think we all have. I mean, really? Nope. Can't be. Uh, let's see. Uh, purple, purple. Uh, oh, my God. Puncture. Let's see. Laceration. High, uh, hydrocolpus. Uh, uh, esophoria. Oh, my God. Disorder. Delivery. Contusions. Complications. All right. Kilts and Emmerich are going to be at the New York uh, Keto Symposium. Uh, and we're going to have our Keto for Fertility Cookbook. But this is for a fertile life. Darren, how you doing? Eats right before bedtime. Very best. And I eat fatty meat. I eat a little bit of cheese. Uh, again, this is radical shit, is it not? Radical. That's not what that I was taught in medical school residency. And afterwards, what was Kilts taught? To eat fruits and vegetables. I got sick. I needed a doctor. They keep on saying bad genes, Right. And, and maybe, you know, I learned after a while, maybe it was, it was bad advice from the doctors. All right. This is what I eat almost every single day. Uh, butter, uh, uh, butter, blue cheese, and fatty ribeye steak. That is it. What do I eat almost every single day? This is it. How boring. Well, my friends, I don't live a boring life. I live a very fantastic, energized, creative life painting, pottery, poetry. I get to communicate with you every day, right? Won't put us in a starvation mode and a hold the weight. Fasting is the very, very, very best. Look at Bella, uh, Coach Steven, Coach Raymond, Coach, um, oh my God, uh, Emily, uh, Coach Cherish, uh, Adek and, and more. Uh, look at Rivero Health, Sean Baker, some really great coaches and cheerleaders. Uh, Judy Cho, amazing. Austin Cavelli, amazing. White cup. All right. I'm doing some more. This morning I was in the studio. I loaded the kiln some more, brought some more cups. I'm working on the whites and the blues. The whites and the blues are really my favorites. Uh, again, we have some other pots also. Uh, all of them are for sale, by the way. This one has a little bottom uh, problems, but it's still, they're all, they're all an investment in whatever you'd like. Uh, even some of my paintings, but be the painter, the potter, the poet, the musician, right? You are it every single day. Uh, let's see. There, we're, this week, they're finishing up the details, they tell me. Uh, suffered from bowel bleeding for years. I did too. Oh my God, 911 bleeding. Oh my God, my poop hurt to put out there, right? Uh, colonoscopies, medicines never healed me. I did carnivore. I stopped vegetables. All gone, right? All gone. Wow. I, you know, it's so unbelievable. All right. I set things down and like, where'd it go? I set things down and where'd it go? Uh, we're all we're all part of the amazing show. Uh, look at this journal. Uh, we have a link on our website, drkilts.com. It's called Poisonous Plant Research. Uh, it is... These animals also suffer from plant poisonings. Uh, they're meant to eat it, right? We're not. And why do we suffer from all diseases? This is a uh, uh, quirky, quirky lady. Uh, it's the same reason these animals do. But when, when, when livestock gets sick, someone loses money. But when you and I get sick, someone makes a lot of money. Again, no disrespect to any of those people that are doing the work. But maybe we're we're looking for something that's 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 the mystery. Listen, the GI tract is supposed to be low in bacteria yeast, and it's supposed to be high in the mucopolysaccharides, the glycosaminoglycans, right? The uh, heparin sulfates. Uh, we've been duped, duped. Sorry, duped in our poop. You're not supposed to have one poop a day. I have one to two poops a week. There's no more blood, no more pain, no more constipation. Listen, constipation is a made up disease also. No animal goes around like, God, I haven't had a bowel movement today. Oh my God, I haven't had a bowel movement today. Oh my God, what am I going to do? Please. 
master you, right? Right, 420? All right. You guys are amazing. Amazing. Darren, eat tallow and boost fat consumption. Yes. Listen, carnivore is a 80% fat calories in your nutrition. I hate the word diet. Diet's dead. Carnivore's alive. All right. Diet's dead. Carnivore's alive. Uh, I, uh, this is it. I eat meat. I eat meat. That's what we got to add to this. I eat meat. All right. Put that, write that down, Malcolm. So I will remember I eat meat. All right. I'll write it down. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Any, any, any S, uh, Perno, I guess. Jazz, how you doing, my friend? Kathy Hall, a beautiful day in the universe. And remember, the universe is created in the mind. That's why The Biology of Belief by Bruce Lipton is a rock-solid, amazing book. I, I, I've, I'm, just, I'm just throwing it all, all around every single day. Uh, check out Bruce Lipton's book, The Biology of Belief. I do drop things from time to time. Uh, I eat meat. I eat vegetarians. That's the other one. I eat vegans. That's better. I eat vegans, pigs, cows, and sheep. Uh, we're having fun, and you got to have fun every day. We're not arguing against anyone's belief system, whatever vegan, vegetarian, Mediterranean, carnivorians, whatever you choose. It's like your religions, your politics, social, cultural, whatever it is. But know this. Mary Jane, you are awesome. You are awesome. Let's see. Kathy, awesome. Sandy, awesome. Autumn, awesome. You are awesome. Do the mirror work, right, Frenchie? Uh, really? Yes. It's so simple. Babies. What's the baby's way? Where is it? Wait. Again, uh, bacon, eggs, butter, beef, kilts is ice cream from time to time. Uh, intermittently feasting all the time. That means one meal, I'll give you a little snack. Okay, just because we're addicted to snacking and eating. Uh, and uh, salt. I love Redmond's, Malden, Himalayan, but whatever your local salt is that you like, this is the very best. And uh, what water does kill drink? Gerald Steiner. Uh, but Topo Chico, my good friend, phase two. And uh, it's, uh, it's Suicide Awareness Month. Uh, we're aware that suicide is very common. Uh, depression, anxiety, fear, and worry are very common. My bet is if you look at Georgia Eid and Kilts and Georgia Eid are going to do a live, I think either September or October. Uh, she's magical on our conversation about psychological diseases are all secondary to eating like a what? Like a pig counting a sheep when you should eat like a... Right? That's it. Eat like this and you'll live like this, right? We are the lionesses and the lions. Mrs. Quirk, medicines, et cetera, never healed when I learned carnivore and stopped the vegetables. Stop being a vegetable, my friend. The, the hospitals, the sanitariums, uh, the, uh, the all full of it. Heroin, drugs, uh, alcohol, marijuana, tobacco, uh, they're all deadly for us, my friends. They're all deadly. Uh, slow it down. Gluconeogenesis. Well, gluconeogenesis, making glucose, right? Your bodies make glycans, glycan neogenesis. Ultimately, your body has no requirement to eat a plant, but you must eat fatty, fatty, fatty meat to be healthy. Red fatty meat is the, the master class. All right, chicken, turkey, no but lamb and goat fatty, right? Elk, but you got to eat the fat, my friends. You must eat the fat to be fittest and ever. And if there's a famine and you're skinny, you're fertilizer, right? So look at all these, all these metabolic pathways. I think I had it. Maybe I'll print another one up. The metabolic pathways are great scientific trickery, maybe. Listen, none of these things happen in isolation, right? Your body uses acetyl-CoA to make energy. That's as simple as that. Simple, right? Like a lion, of course, uh, uh, and step uh, by step, get in there. We got to learn to dance in life, right? Uh, get Go to a dance studio. There's so many dance studios out there. They're just sitting waiting for you to learn to dance. 
or music studios or painting or pottery. The food we eat is there for us to fuel the Ferrari to be creative. But if you're being a simple herbivore and eating and stuffing yourself all day, which I would do and I've done, but when I went carnivore, it all went away. That's it. Uh, was I still gain weight even when I'm carnivore because I can eat way too much meat since I love the taste. You've got to control that, my friend. Up the, up the fat, eat one meal a day. you got to control going to the refrigerator. I can't control it. You fucking can control it. Who's in charge of what you put in here and in here? You are. Kilts is uh, in the Mighty Tribe, a 72-hour fast at least once a month. And you do 23 and 1. Listen, is it, is it hard to pick this up and do 10 of them three times a day, even though it sits right here? Yes. Uh, but, and I have a refrigerator down here. It's filled with butter. Ah, it's all gone. And I stay out of the kitchen because when you go in the kitchen, guess what you want to do? Eat food, Autumn, right? Uh, carna, uh, carna, uh, friggin' vor. Uh, it is actually that's a good one. Carna, I put a uh, carna friggin' vor, uh, is a kiltivore ultimately, right? The mighty tribe. And uh, my friend Tosh has designed this great. And if you want one, we're gonna put them on. Uh, and and uh, it's not meant to be uh, a weapon. It's meant to be uh, a uh, ornament, and uh, but ultimately in our ancient past, and even if uh, if somehow there's a, a mighty uh, 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 nuclear holocaust in this globe, uh, the plants win, right? And uh, we, my friend, uh, are always on the side of the gods, right? 23, one, 48, one time a week, and 72 a month, carnivore Chucky. That's, that's Kiltz's mighty way, right? Uh, that and the hard one, the hard one is 72. But once you get to 48, it's fucking easy. Darren, uh, Spear, yes, we do. Listen, what do we men want to do? We want to get in the motion studio and lift heavy weights. Look at Sean Baker's stuff on um, on on uh, high intensity exercise, but in in just little spurts, right? Just little spurts. But look at, don't spend all your day exercising. Spend all your day being creative, right? Spondyl, uh, spondylithitis. Uh, guess what it's caused by? Plants. Come fly with uh, surge. Plants. Don't eat fruit, fiber, vegetables, seeds, or nuts. Don't eat honey or fruit of any frequency or significance. And the same goes with alcohol, coffee, tea, and all other plant material. Right? Uh, let's see. All right. Mia, how you doing? Buenos dias. Uh, day, night with the best. Try blessings. Start the day. Finish the day. I'm doing my 5 a.m. and I may be working on like a 7 or 8 p.m. I am inspired every single day to be here with you. That is it, right? Inspired every day to be here with you. And what I'm learning as a physician what am I learning as a physician? Well, I've been taught to uh, feed you like an herbivore. And then you'll get the diseases and you'll need me. And then I give you a drug and you think how wonderful I am or a dissection. Uh, my friend, raw sugar. I, I just, uh, and honey time to time. That's okay. Uh, the, uh, the key that not letting the plants get best of us. And listen, that's why you... Even the food in the refrigerator, even if it's eating steak all day, you're not an herbivore. You're a lion. Lions just sit there in the in the midst of the herds of buffalo, and they just take a nap. But what should you do? Get in the, the, the woodworking studio or the design studio, or you're going to read a great book, and then you're going to share it in a book club, right? Uh, maybe we should have our monthly book club and talk about the book. Uh, maybe we add that to the Mighty Tribe also. Only cook the amount of meat you need to eat and walk away. Absolutely. What I do is I like to, I'll cut my, my big ribeye into thirds. I'll cook the one third, put the rest in the fridge, dry age it for one to two to three days. Add some uh, Maldon or Redmond salt. Oh, not the best. 
Uh, we have Alpine and Snake River tonight. Uh, we are going to put links to all of the mighty places you can go to get the very best. And we're not limiting it. We want to expand it. Uh, put it on the Mighty Tribe or drkilts.com. Uh, we're working on Kilts Health, which is really going to bring in traditional medicine, but focusing on things like nutrition, meditation, prayer, a proper exercise, not excessive, but proper motion, right? That's where, I'm, and, and there are so many great coaches, cheerleaders, uh, gyms to go to, to get a coach and cheerleader. It's really, really, really important, right? Uh, let's see, be uh, in that book club. Awesome. Uh, again, uh, once a month, we're going to bring in a, 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 a motivator, uh, Judy Cho, Sean Baker, Ken Berry, uh, uh, I think we have Maria Emmerich coming up on the Mighty Tribe once a month. We'll maybe do the book club uh, once a month, but most of it is about sharing your story. Maybe one hour isn't enough. Maybe we need two. Oh, my God. Every Sunday, 7 p.m. But I think uh, Chafee's Patreon group is at 7 p.m. Eastern time. So we'll 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 balance it. Right. Uh, Carl Coleman. Awesome. Thanks. Bevy. Chucky. Uh, yep. 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 Oh my gosh, what an awesome, amazing day that we're here today. Uh, I eat herbivores, right? Uh, ruminant animals, but listen, I, I don't know. We're, we're, we're so like, if you want to eat chicken or fish, go at it, but you must add the fat. And I say chicken shit and fish smells and chicken, if you leave it open, it smells. The bacteria, yeast, and viruses love it. Right, Autumn, where's the uh, Carney uh, Fick and Vore t-shirt? It's coming, it's coming. Grandmother taught us not to eat vegetables because they would make us sick. Later in life, uh, I ate them and got sick. Sandy, that is real. Listen, again, uh, your comments are so critical and important. We have been lied to by the doctors, right? Now, we've been taught the wrong thing. That's it. Uh, can you talk more about September 24th? Autumn, uh, let's see, look up. A uh, keto keto symposium, New York City keto symposium, the first keto conference in New York City, uh, September oh September twenty third and twenty fourth. Learn about the ketogenic lifestyle. All right, I'll make sure I'm there on the twenty third and the twenty fourth. Now I got to look at my my real schedule. Uh, 23rd, Friday, what time? And we'll see what time it starts. And uh, let's see, 23rd of September. Uh, where are we at? Uh, yes, uh, Keto Symposium, 23rd and 24th, New York City. It's the first Keto Symposium. Uh, uh, I will be there. Uh, we have a great booth. We're going to share in, guess what? Shirts and books. Uh, and ideas, and I'm there to, to maybe even make some of Kiltz's ice cream, right? Autumn, awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, so be there, uh, just uh, just ketosymposium.com. Uh, uh, let's see, see our speakers. Who's going to be there speaking? Uh, let's see, uh, it's going to be, uh, your host is uh, Krista, Christina Hess, dietitian, nutritionist, health coach. So be there, be square, right? Uh, we're, Kilts is going to be there. We'll have some Kilts Tribe shirts for everyone. My daughter hated veggies since age three. Fit with uh, Malek. Uh, let's see. I used to go, uh, let's see, furious until I unlearned how now we are best, uh, best, 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 best friends on carnivore. Flying colors. I am a real believer in carnivore, but I look a lot at anthropology and I wonder why things like fruits are so bad. Listen, um, we ate what we could eat. And of course, we ate fruits, seeds, vegetables from time to time, but they weren't around most of the time. Listen, whatever you want to eat, eat it. But fruits and honey of any frequency or significance is not good for the master class, right? And the master class is you, carnivores. So a little bit from time to time, but Fruits, vegetables, seeds, and nuts are highly antigenic. 
that means they induce an inflammatory reaction. And if it's the anaphylactic reaction and you don't have an EpiPen or a hospital quickly nearby, you're fertilizer. So what I say is that I believe fruits, fiber, vegetables, seeds, and nuts of any frequency or significance cause cancer, heart disease, hypertension, dementia, diabetes, even type one and type two is caused by plants. That's it. Uh, so let's make sure we have keto symposium on our website, Dr. Kiltz, inviting all to be there. Uh, amazing, amazing people. Uh, let's see, what do we got here? Uh, it's going to be Robert Sykes, uh, Anna Kabeka, Cynthia Thurlow, Temple Stewart, Dorian Greenow, Mindy Peltz, uh, Ben Azid, uh, Azadi, uh, Trio Collegian, Love Tro Collegian. Uh, Pompa, Dan Pompa, Maria Emmerich, Nina Tolchin, uh, Catherine Ar uh, Arnston, Maggie and Brad Jones, Thomas uh, Duraj, and uh, Christina Hess. So be there, be square, right? You define infrequently. Uh, maybe a couple times a month, that's it. Uh, I would rather eat white sugar in my ice cream uh, two times a week than fruit two times a week. But again, uh, you're you're going to find what works for you, but cancer is and all these diseases are silently doing their damage until they're no longer silent. You either drop dead or you need the, the medical community to give you drugs to make you better. That's it. Right. Uh, Darren uh, mentioned how you're going to break your fast with electrolytes and minerals. I go straight to my fatty meat. Listen. Oh, your bowels, listen, a lion doesn't say, well, let me let me have a little bit of mineral water uh, before I put the real meat in. Uh-uh. You don't need that. We like to sell the ideas. My bowels are best when I fasted and they are healed. The glycobiome is magical and beautiful. I'm going to be talking about the glyco check, which is a means of checking your glycobiome and making sure it's in the very best shape. Right? Again, these ideas are radical. Uh, flying color science uh, from time to time. Again, we're making this complicated. It's fucking simple. Kiss. Keep it simple. Stupid. I'm the stupid one. I'm the dumb one. Uh, bio lane made about you. No, I'm sure it's good. I've got, listen, if someone's talking about kilts, it's a good thing, right? Uh, let's see. No news is, no news is bad news, as they say. Uh, we're out there. There's so many different ideas, but there's only one truth. God, right? God is all there is. So love and forgiveness, kindness to everyone. We're not here to have a fight. We're here to have a beautiful wrestle in the mud. And we all love the mud, right? We love getting dirty sometime, but you got to be loving, kind and generous to your, to your enemies, your family, your friends, your foes. But most of all, be nice to you this day and every day, right? The whole intention of the 5 a.m. club is what? Is simply some positivity, learning some ideas how you can change the world, all right? How can you change the world? Uh, Bevy, right? Uh, it's Is it really? I don't know. Uh, but uh, I used to play a lot more, but then... We are carnivores, my friend, even in the very end. It told you to eat plants, poop you do. Blood is everywhere and pain you see when you're a carnivore. All goes away. Doctors become friends and no longer do they give you drugs. Crystal crazy, kills crazy hits, of course. Listen, we're all playing, not a boo, right? Jeanette, how you doing, my friend? God is good and great this day. Remember, we're all the gods. It's within everyone. And whether you're vegan, vegetarian, Mediterranean, pescatarian, heart, 
Carnivary and life is good, right? If you're suffering and you want to heal, Bevy, what do you do? You listen to Kiltsy Morning. Kilts in the morning is crazy, you see. Carnivore is all we be, my friends. All is healing every day, my friends of life. All I know is my grandmother taught me to eat vegetables. No. Who taught you that, right? TV, the radio, the magazines to sell you mush and make you meek. But when you eat meat, you become the master. Men, the mommies, the masters of life eat meat. And they're not worried about how much or when and what's the right amount. They simply eat fatty meat. That's it, done. Once a day, my friends, simple and easy. Larry Ryan, good morning, my friend. Positivity and blessings. All about positivity and blessings every day. Get your drum and drum away. Get your clarinet, your flute, whatever you played when you were younger, get it out. Start playing it again. Art. Focus more on the art of life, not eating all the time. Listen, that's the beauty of carnivore. It's so damn simple. And the baby's way is best. Eat meat. Listen. God bless you, Bevy. Science optimized started. Thanks for following. We're all co-following each other, by the way. Mark K. He's crazy. Fucking crazy. I love his crazy shit. Uh, he's going to be taking down Kilts, by the way. He's going to be this guy. Kilts is fucking nuts. Doesn't know what he's talking about. And I'm inspired by Bart K. Listen, we're all telling a story. It's all entertainment. Stop eating. New carbon fiber violin. Nice. Nice. My daughter, Pilar, is a violinist. Kilts and, and uh, Kilts. Uh, and, and and Pilar Castro, Isabella Castro Kilts. Uh, today's Miss Gina's birthday. Happy birthday, Miss Gina. Uh, 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 Pilar's mom. Beautiful birthday. The 7th. Oh, my God. September 7th. Uh, was she a 56? Yes. Uh, 66 is the best year ever. I am at it. Uh, do you bake uh, the meat or fry it? I put it under the broiler, uh, the, the uh, auto wild, but some others less expensive on, on, um, on uh, Amazon also, but I just put it in my home broiler. I have a Viking broiler. I have a big fan. We're going to cook the steaks in that tonight. Uh, seven ish tonight. So we plan on seven, 7 PM live with kilts, uh, making meat, right? Uh, Larry, Mia, Darren, awesome. Uh, Mauricia, good morning from Australia. Let's see. Uh, Chafee, uh, Fetke, uh, uh, oh my gosh, I got all these names. I'm getting them going. Uh, they're just some amazing. Look at low carb down under. Amazing. Bake or fry in cast iron butter depends on my mood. Sear with a rare finish. I take my cold steak, put it under the broiler darken it up with some salt only, flip it over, do it again, slice it up. It's black and blue, the very best. You don't want to overcook your meat. You'll damage the proteins, you'll damage the minerals and the vitamins, and you'll melt away the fat. But if the melted fat is in a bowl, a pan, pour it back on it, eat the fat because the fat makes you fit and fertile, right? That's it. Uh, let's see. The Keto Symposium. Let's see, Miss Maria Emmerich. Uh, let's see, exempt. Uh, let's see, uh, four exhibitors. Uh, let's see, do they have us listed down there? Uh, I think uh, we should be in the diamond group. I think we are. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, but if not, we should be. All right. Uh, Cherry, uh, Cherry, uh, Tara Tomasto, I think. Uh, crazy hits. Medium rare, you think, okay. Uh-uh. Look at start there. It's better to start somewhere, but add the butter, add the fat. Uh, I go to rare, black and blue. Rare is, is you are a rare one. Remember, you are so rare, right, Larry? Fat is the fuel for the mitochondria. That's it. If anyone says sugar is and glucose is, uh, ask them, well, why would the mitochondria use glucose when it's got tons of fat? And Fat just cleaves a, a two-carbon to make acetyl-CoA, but 
glucose has to go to pyruvate and then it has to go to acetyl-CoA. Like, explain that to me. Uh, I don't believe it's true. See, once you created a belief system, it's so hard to change beliefs, right? See, we, we've given we've given glucose sort of like the hierarchy. My friends, fat is it, and we are meant to get fat fast and easy, and we're not meant to get skinny. Skinny in a famine, your fertilizer. Uh, do rare, got to make the jump. All right, you, you're going to go from, you're going to go from like, overdone then you go to medium rare rare and then uh 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 what is it uh, blue and then raw i love raw meat listen the very best then uh, raw rob and rocking every day walk is is man's best medicine absolutely you don't need to run you don't need to lift the weights go into nature plant your garden till the soil uh Grow the plants so you have the decoration of the flowers. Uh, it's all, for me, uh, in a kilts pot. Uh, maybe we'll do this. Uh, the, the flowers, right? The flowers are critical as decoration. And we do use them. We do use plants as medicinal, right? But the plants are the source of the abortion pill, the, uh, the birth control pill, and they cause blood clots and damage to your uterus, massive hemorrhaging, bleeding uh, to your brain, brain fog, to your eyes, I can't see, to hearing, what'd you say? Uh, to your joints, your skin, eczema everywhere, it goes away on carnivore, right? What diseases can we rid? All of them, bacteria with raw meat, bacteria on chicken and fish, but not on a ribeye steak. Uh-uh. See, I buy the the big and I cut it. That's the very best way. Get the big, you know, the long one, dry age it, cut what you want in the day. Listen, that is the very best way, right? We walk in man's mocking, walking. Let's go for a walk, right? Uh, no concerns. No concerns. Uh, right. When was the last time you heard a ribeye steak being recalled? Uh, everyone died from a ribeye steak. They're dying from salad, vegetables, fruit. Sorry. Sorry, carnivore heels, right? Do you want to be, do you want to be, I don't know if you can see the animals here. What do we have? We have horses, cows, uh, let's see, goats, llamas, and sheep. Which one do you want to be, right? I think this one, this next, the next one is going to be, I eat these guys, right? That's it. Uh, I'll try uh, tonight ground Wagyu ground, but you got to, it's always better to get the Wagyu and grind it yourself. But if they're getting a really great price on ground beef, get it. It's still a rock star. Uh, I have a ton of ground beef in the fridge. Maybe I'll throw in a little bit of that. We'll do a threesome tonight, right? It's going to be a cooking. I'm going to cook and then maybe I'll eat while I cook and uh, sips of Gerald Steiner. Alisa, how are you doing? Crazy kilts, right? Uh, and and uh, kilts is mighty tribe, but it's kilts is meat time, right? Uh, all the time. Victoria, how to overcome cravings uh, on carnivore? Keep craving cashew nuts. Well, grab some grab grab some ribeye, slice off some ribeye, eat a salami, a little bit of, of blue cheese or parmesan. That's what I go for. Listen, uh, I too crave, and what do I do sometimes? I pull out kilts is ice cream. I have a bowl of Kiltz's ice cream. Listen, the nuts contain the, the, the antigens that cause all the damage. Sorry. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, we're all going to uh, the, uh, the 22 uh, Symposium in New York City. Great, 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 amazing uh, uh, speakers. Uh, we'll put that on our, on, our, uh, uh, on our stuff as a sponsor. Uh, oh, Dr. Kiltz is a sponsor. Keto Mojo, uh, the Keto, nutri keto Nutritionist, uh, Ken uh, Etik of uh, Fuel Your Life, uh, Dry Farm Wines, uh, let's see, Bits Algae Tablets. You get a lot of uh, iodine from those algae tablets. And the algae tablets reduce inflammation in your bloodstream. Wagyu, uh, Paleo Valley, Real Goods, Keto Brick. Uh, keto Brick is uh, Savage, uh, Robert Sykes, uh, and Keto IQ, Ketone IQ, and uh, 
Chalk Zero. So really, really great people there. We're excited about it. Uh, so much great stuff coming. Happy Fatty Day. Oh, 5.59. All right. Kilts as the day of fertility work. But uh, 7 p.m. live tonight. Uh, eight too late for me. Uh, I guess I could do eight, but I'll do seven. Victor Seaman. Uh, Mito, uh, me, uh, Meta Pulsa. Are there any sausage we can eat? Uh, you can make them. Make sure they don't have much in the way of spices, seeds, or nuts. Then I think if it's pork and you want to throw in some chicken, yeah, but I stick to pork, uh, beef, uh, tallow, lard, a uh, lamb. Amazing. I can talk all day long. Make time to enjoy our lives. Look at it's 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 about the fuel to move and do something, right? Uh, uh, KiltsHealth.com is coming, uh, but DrKilts.com is all you need. Health and wellness. And don't forget, uh, who's in charge of your health and wellness? The new carnivore is coming, and we'll have pra, uh, uh, some pre-copies at the Aikido Symposium uh, for your perusal. I love you, my friends. Uh, Veracruz, uh, Veracruzer, uh, I will uh, grind it mostly. It just, I, I like, I will, but I, I, that's, again, grinding up and ground beef, it likely digests a lot better, right? All right, uh, Alisa Crossroads Spiritual Boutique, good morning to you. If I missed you, I apologize. Really, I'm grateful for everyone out there. If you don't catch me at 5 a.m. later in the day through replay or reruns, but tonight at 7 p.m., uh, Kilts is cooking. I love you, my friends. God bless.